हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज गुजर पल्लवी शिवाजी माय सेमिनार टॉपिक इज एनिमल हेलमेंट फ्रॉम इकोनॉमिक जुलॉजी एनिमल हेलमेंट हेलमेंट्स आर द पैरासाइटिक बर्म दैट बिलोंग्स टू द फायला प्लैटी हेलमेंट एंड निमेट हेलमेंट दिस वर्म्स आर द सॉफ्ट बॉडीड एनिमल देर बॉडी इज जॉन्सो डॉर्सोवेंट्रली फ्लैटर एंड बायोलैटरली सिमेट्रिकल हेलमेंट आर डिवाइडेड इन टू अ थ्री क्लासेस that is trematoda cystoda and nematoda firstly we are going to discuss about trematoda animal belong to this class are generally leaf like and body is covered with a cuticle they have the organs of the attachment which are found on their anterior end of the body there is presence of the well developed alimentary canal in this trematoda worms the animal of this class are the ecto or the endoparasite they are generally found in the man and other animals they include the fluke parasite on the man and other animals so the example of this trematoda are phaseolopsis buski and a chistosoma mansoni the first example is phaseolopsis buski its classification is the phylum is platyhelminthes because its body is flat class is trematoda order is digenia genus phaseolopsis and a species is buski its character it is a large intestinal fluke of man dog and the pigs it is found in the man dog and as well as also in the pigs it measure up to a 20 to 75 micrometer in length and 8 to 20 micrometer in breadth its pharynx is small esophagus is short and the cloaca is long and diverticulate gonad occupy a posterior region of their body this phaseolopsis buski causes a infection the infective stages are the metacercaria larva found in the aquatic plant development of these parasite take place in a snail this infective stage of this endoparasite is a metacercaria and which is found on the aquatic plants and the development of this parasite is take place in the snail body and the infective stage larva enter the host body by eating a water plants particularly like the water caldrops trapa in the intestine of the host the metacercaria develop into a adult stage which take place within the 3 months adult worm cause erosion of lining of digestive tract result in bleeding and pain in the intestine of the host sometimes this also causes the vomiting and the diarrhea in the host prevention and control of this phaseolopsis buski include the control of the snail firstly we have to control this snail because its primitive stages are found or the primitive stages of its development is found in the snail or it complete its development development and the life cycle stages in the snail that's why we have to control the snail use the antihelminthic drugs like the hexyl resorcinol and crystalloids it is used for the control of the uh, disease so the next class is cystoda and uh, in the cystoda the individuals of this class are commonly known as the tapworm they are the endoparasite of the men and the other animals so the example of this cystoda is a tenia solium and a tenia saginata and out of these two we are going to discuss only about the tenia solium tenia solium classification phylum is a platyhelminthes a class is cystoda order is tenioidi genus is tenia and species is a solium characters it is commonly called as the porkworm 
and found in a small intestine of the man. So this worm is found in the small intestine of the man and it infects the small intestine of man. And it is commonly called as the pork tapeworm because it its intermediate host is the pig. It is cosmopolitan in distribution. It is opaque white in color. Infection highly found in the China, Germany, India, Yugoslavia because the peoples in the China and Germany highly eat or include the pig flesh or the pig pork in their diet. They are the endoparasite of the man and the other animal. Their body is slender, elongated, flat and the ribbon like in shape. Their body is uh, differentiated into a three region that is the scolex, neck and the strobila. And the scolex bear the sucker and the hooks for the attachment. Life cycle involves primary host and intermediate host. The primary host is man and the intermediate host is the pig. Infection. The cell fertilization takes place within the same proglottid. The fertilized egg gate detached from the body of the tapeworm and pass out of the host body in the form of the chain with the fecal matter. This fertilized egg if taken by the other pig along with the feces, these reach the intestine of the pig where they are hatched into the hook embryos. And these uh, are then penetrate into the intestinal wall of the pig and reach to the muscle through the bloodstream. In the muscle they grow and form the cysticerous larvae which is still covered with the bladder. If this uncooked uh, uh, pork is eaten by the or taken by the man then the cysticerous larvae reach to the alimentary canal and develop there. And they, due to the presence of the hooks and the sucker these larvae uh, attach to the intestine of the man and attain a adult lar adult stage. Its infection causes the nausea, anemia and the indigestion in the host. Prevention and control Use a properly cooked food and use quinocrine, hydrochloride and the atarbin to control the diseases. So this is the diagrammatic representation of the infection uh, infection of this uh, tenuous oleum in the human and or in man and the pig. Next is the next class is nematoda. The individual of this class are commonly known as the roundworm. These are the parasitic on animal as well as the plant. They are found in every ecological condition. The main requirement of uh, these uh, nematodes are the water. They inhabit in the fresh water, salt water, animal and the plant tissues. Example of these nematodes are the Ascaris lumbricoid and the Encyclostoma. And uh, uh, between these two we are going to discuss only about the Ascaris lumbricoid. Ascaris lumbricoid, its classification, phylum is nematelminthes, order is ascaroidae, genus is ascaris, species is lumbricoid. So the general characters of the ascaris lumbricoid. It is commonly called as the round worm and inhabit the small intestine of the man and are more common in the children. It is cosmopolitan in the distribution. It completes its life cycle in the intermediate host. Okay. The mouth of the Ascaris is uh, uh, bounded by the three lips. Uh, the one upper lips are the dorsal lip and the two ventrolateral lip. The lip have the papillae and the amphid which are gustatory in the function and the animal show the sexual dimorphism. The female is longer than the male. 
the female uh, in the female the anus is separate opening but in male the anus and the genital aperture open posteriorly in the common chamber and the posterior head of the male is curved ventrally the infection eggs are released with the feces of the host under the neonatal condition these egg develop into a rhabditoid larvae which is an infective stage and this reaches to the intestine of the man with the contaminated water or the food in the host intestine this egg egg shell dissolve and the juvenile hatch out and it bore the intestine and enter the hepatic portal system and distributed to the liver heart and the lungs and then it reaches to the pharynx and after reaching to pharynx it enter the gut where it attempt the adult stage and this adult stage causes the ascariasis in the children it is more common in the children than the adult so larvae causes complication to kidney muscle brain spinal cord lung etc a lumbricoid causes colic pain ulcer diarrhea eosinophilia appendicitis and the tumor so this is the diagrammatic representation of the ascaris lumbricoid infection and the uh, stages in the man the prevention and control before eating wash the uh, vegetables and uh, properly cook these vegetables use anti helminthic drug like the uh, oil of sinopodium uh, alcopor bendex gentel etc so here we have completed our topic that is the animal helminth thank you